If we have to explain the effect of an increase in income on the market for goods and services, we start with our initial equilibrium position. In other words, firstly, we have to draw a diagram of the market showing the equilibrium position in the market. Equilibrium price, equilibrium quantity. Now there's an increase in income. An increase in income leads to an increased demand for goods and services. Graphically, we can illustrate this by a rightward shift of the demand curve. And that would be our second step. The increase in demand leads to an increase in the price and quantity in the market. So, prices increase and quantity also increase. But we have to explain why did prices increase? Why did the quantity increase? Well, at our initial position, PE, we had excess demand. Now, if we have excess demand, competition amongst buyers' demand will push up the price. And as the price increase, quantity supplied would increase and quantity demanded goes to the equilibrium position, where quantity demanded is equal to quantity supplied. To summarize, if we have to explain, first step, the initial market condition, PE and QE. Secondly, there was a change. This is shown by the rightward shift of the demand curve. Third step, the new equilibrium position. Fourthly, we need to explain in our example, we said, well, we had an excess demand and that led to the increase in prices.